What's up boys, my name is Sol, and um, this is just a review of my um, FNAF, uh, FNAF fan game that I've made in Unity of like the past four days. Um, I know um, I haven't had a lot of time to like code, I've, I think I've only had about like a month's worth of um, coding practice or coding experience. But um, yeah, this is basically my game, um, and if I just go ahead and run it, it's called One Night at uh, Molten Spring Traps, right here as you can see. If I just go ahead and open it. As you can see, we got Molten Spring Trap right here. That's what I named it. I think he's called like Fire Spring Trap or something. Um, I'm not entirely sure on his name, but I just decided to call him um, Molten Spring Trap. So, uh, yeah. Um, let's just go ahead and play. So, we're going to get a 12 a.m. screen. Um, it's only one night. So, uh, yeah, it's not five nights because five nights does take a lot of time. All right, so you can look around. And I've made it so you can't use a mouse at all, you have to use keybinds. So, E is to open your cameras and you can navigate throughout the cameras. Um, this is basically like the equivalent of the marionette. Um, yeah, you can uh, do uh, F for an audio box. Okay, uh, you can listen hi. to the call. Welcome to Toys World, a magical and fun place where kids can come and play with toys and imagination is the only limit. Uh, you may be wondering why this, um, why this doesn't look like a toy factory at all. And that's because around five years ago, this place caught on fire due to an animatronic malfunctioning. And um, yeah, we were very lucky to recover some of the old parts and we could re rebuild the animatronics. But you just need to monitor them to make sure nothing happens to them or, you know, they don't break or anything. Uh, yeah, if they do, just contact us and uh, we will be in there just to try fix the problem. We've recently installed a security camera system in our, um, in our building. So yeah, you can just check the security cameras instead of having to, you know, manually walk around and uh, check on the animatronics. So uh, yeah, about a little bit of information about the animatronics. Uh, we got our main one on the stage. Uh, his name was Springtrap, but uh, yeah, we call him Molten Springtrap now because of the fire. Yeah, guy sounds like a really cool name, you gotta admit. Um, anyways, he will sometimes get uh, a little bit wandery. He'll just kind of wander around um, and he has to keep he has to keep moving constantly, or else his spring lock, his spring lock suit will lock up, and those parts will be useless. So uh, just make sure to play the audio clip when he's uh, when he's coming close to you, if or if he's coming close to you, uh, just to put him back where he is, because he likes children. He really wants to entertain children, and the audio clip is a child. Uh, yeah, and our second guy is a little bit advanced. He has a um, self-powering system or a self-charge system where he doesn't need to be manually charged, he can just charge himself. Uh, whatever you do, do not let him fully charge himself because he will go wander and um, we've had a little bit of incidents with him, incidences. Uh, yeah, whatever you do, I'm gonna say this again, do not let the battery power reach its full, uh, reach, reach fullness, uh, whatever. Just do not let him fully charge, okay? Um, yeah, if you do that, you should be good for the night. And um, yeah, have a great night. Uh, yeah, that's basically the call. Um, I'm definitely going to shorten it in the future because that was like seven years long. But yeah, I'm going to add another animatronic that un hides under your desk, and you have to you have to make sure that your um, your camera's down, um, or else you die, because he can get you by surprise. And uh, yeah, that forces you to basically not be out camp cameras, and you have to make sure to um, uh, look down under the desk and make sure that that animatronic's not there. Um, yeah, see, this one's basically like the marionette. You just got to keep on making sure to reset the power. And Spring Trap basically moves uh, like Spring Trap, like from the original Five Nights at Freddy's 3. And uh, yeah, this is basically my FNAF fan game. I'm actually very proud of this. Um, sometimes the camera um, animation does lag a little bit. As you can see there, like you can, it cuts to the next camera before the animation actually plays. Oh, no, nope, seems to have fixed itself now. Um, yeah, there needs to be a main reason for you to actually be in the office, because right now there's not really a main reason. Uh, you can't really close any doors, but uh, yeah. And when that little flash happens, spring traps moved, and you can use hello? this audio box to... Um, yeah, I know, I just copied Balloon Boy. I just said hello, and... Oh, crap. That nearly got to the end. Um, yeah, so basically all you have to do is just make sure to... you just got to survive the night. Um, this will... Uh, this guy will progressively get harder. Um, I, this is one of the AR animatronics, I think. So the ones that are from FNAF AR. Um, and it keeps on getting faster and faster. And every time you do it, um, it takes two off your power. I'll probably make it take like four or f three or four off your power. Um, yeah, if you have any suggestions, just leave them in the comments below. And I will be sure to check them out. Uh, yeah, I'm going through for my FNAF. Oh, crap, he's moved again. Um, make sure to keep that wound up, wound down. Um, Hello? 
Yeah, um, sometimes he just stays at the same camera, which is good, because, like, he does that in the first game as well. Um, maybe I could make on working, um, uh, I'm probably gonna make a sequel to this, maybe, like, a one night at Molten Spring Traps 2, where you actually have to move around. Um, where did he go? Okay, he's in here. Um, gotta make sure that this guy does not get charged up. That was close. Um, yeah. Hello? Get him out of here. Uh... Yeah, and I will show you what happens once you get, uh, jump scared. Oh, where is he gone? So basically, the jump scare for Springtrap, he just has to get through all your cameras. He gets faster and faster every couple seconds. So what you have to do is just mainly stay on this camera. Um, so what you can do right now is camp on this camera. But what I want you to do is you can go out of here and look under your desk and the fan turned off. Maybe I'll get rid of that fan. Whoa. Okay, that fa get. I need to get rid of that fan right now. Because whatever this is, is amazing. I think the fan was just making it too, um, too safe. And you're not getting creeped out. Gotta make sure Hello? we put him back. Okay. Oh, and that's my TV. Just don't worry about that. Um, yeah. Sorry if this video is so long. I'm just trying to, um, do- Oh, crap. He's moved. Um, yeah. So, as I said before, I'll maybe add another animatronic. Um, okay, that TV's really annoying me. I'll just put both headphones on. Uh-oh. Reset him. Make sure Springtrap isn't Hello? going anywhere. Okay, he's back there. Okay, it's 4 a.m. Um, I'll try to survive this one night. I've actually developed quite a good strat to winning so far. You just gotta not let this guy get here. Okay, he is moving way faster. Um, come on, come on, come on, come on. Okay, reset that. Oh no, nearly out of power. Hello? Crap, no, spring chat moves to the same room. Move that back down. Come on, come on, come on, come on. The audio clip needs to go down faster or else I'm not going to have enough time. Oh shit, we're ah! Ah! Oh! Okay, I don't know what that was, um, the, the static at the end. Um, I'll make sure to fix that. But, um, yeah, that's what happens when you get jump scared by Springtrap. And, uh, yeah, I'll show you what happens when you get jump scared by, um, the other guy. Okay, as you can see here, um, the robot will start glitching out. Uh, so he'll start going all dial-up mode and start like bugging out. And then... <laughs> Jump scare! So, uh, yeah, that's basically my fan game. Um, I really hope you enjoyed. There will definitely be more updates in the future. So uh, make sure to subscribe and uh, turn on the notice if you want to be notified um, if you want anything added to the game. Uh, if you have any ideas for games, drop them down and I'll try and make them. And uh, yeah, make uh, see ya. <laughs>